Okay, so it's uh, surgery day. I've been checked in and uh, defrocked. <laughs> so, um, something I didn't consider, we had to shave the stomach area because it's uh, obviously going to be operated on. They did all the um, taking of um, blood pressure and oxygen and um, just a quick blood glucose level um, and everyone was happy so that's all good. Uh, I'm now in my, my suit. Um, I'm also, uh, I've got these uh, pressure pads on my uh, calves which are just pumping up and down alternatively uh, on a regular basis to stop the old deep vein for thrombosis and um, uh, it's not a, it's, it's a sheet sort of top but the, the blanket they've given me is like it's just pumping hot air through this sort of puffy little thing and it's very warm so very nice so uh, staff are extraordinarily nice they're really lovely uh, great sense of humor so you know that's always good for me and um, yeah they'll be in periodically to check and um, but I can't get out of bed unless uh, I have someone help me now because I'm hooked up to all of this stuff. And then, uh, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm going to go in, so it's uh, 20 past 10 now. I'll be in, I think, around 1 o'clock. So oh, I've still got a two, two, and a two to three hours to go. So, all right, here we go. This is it. It's game on. Okay, so it's there, um, always five, so sorry the way I'm talking, my tongue is so dry and um, just don't have enough spit in my mouth. Um, it's too early for me to take any ice chips, so um, but other than that, I can certainly feel the gas at the moment um, in my tummy, it's a little bit makes me feel a little bit yuck. Um, but pain's probably only about a two out of three, so I'm, I'm doing all right. Um, <laughs> I've got lots of things hooked up to me, which I'll show you in a sec. Uh, Michael's still in surgery at the moment. So I'm um, not back. Um, but other than that, yeah, I feel pretty good. Like when I first came out, I was really feeling shit because I couldn't, I was so out of it, um, but I'm slowly coming right uh, in my head. So, um, but other than that, yeah, I feel quite good. Uh, I'll tell you all about it, the experience later. Okay, so surgery itself, itself was quite weird. Um, I went in to um, the surgery room. They, uh, they told me to uh, scoot across onto the surgery bed. Staff was so lovely down there. Um, scoot across to the surgery bed. They uh, talked to me for about one minute maybe. They said, I'm just gonna put this mask on. Um, and then it was like, I woke back up in my room. It was, I felt like I'd had the mask on for one minute and then, the surgery was done. It was like, it was amazing that it was that fast because I couldn't chicken out, I couldn't change my mind. And then next thing you know, I wake up in my room and go, my head instantly went, what happened? Did I not get the surgery? Um, but I clearly did. I just, yeah, it was amazing. Anyway, I haven't been able to check anything yet and any incisions or anything. It's still obviously early days. Um, yeah. But otherwise, um, I'm doing really well. Uh, you can hear that noise. It's the 
things on my calf muscles. They're pumping me, like my, pumping my calf muscles to keep blood flow. Um, yeah, and I can feel the gas. Um, uh, yeah, and just waiting for Michael to get back out now to make sure he's all okay. Uh, and then we're good. Yeah, so. Hey guys, so now it's 7 p.m. Uh, seven hours after uh, my gastric uh, bypass. So uh, I'm doing really, really well. I've got up and had a little bit of a walk. Uh, I went to see Michael, but he was still sleeping. So I just sort of snuck in there and told him I love him and, and then uh, snuck back out. Um, doing really good. Uh, my mouth feels like a sewer. Um, <laughs> Because I ha I'm super dehydrated and uh, I'm not up to having any ice chips or anything yet. Uh, so uh, I've just been putting a bit of clo wet cloth around the inside of my mouth to help. Um, but other than that, pain-wise, that's good. Uh, the gas is definitely an issue. But even then, I'd say sort of my pain's only about a five out of ten. So manageable. But uh, yeah. It's uh, just a little bit uncomfortable. I need to walk around a little bit more, but um, when I did get up to go for a walk, I felt a little bit dizzy, um, but they said that's to be expected because uh, I'm still got my anesthetic and stuff that's wearing off me and that sort of stuff. So um, have to wear this ox oxygen mask and um, you'll see here, I've got okay, uh, fluid bag and stuff like that. That's attached to me, so that's only, um, for uh, the gastric uh, bypass patients, not the sleeve. And that's just in case there's any fluid coming out of the wound itself. Um, so, uh, but that will get probably removed tomorrow. Um, it just basically removes any excess blood or um, anything that's coming out of the wound um, internally. So they just uh, remove that tomorrow and it's all good. Um, but otherwise, I'm feeling in high spirits. It was a weird um, thing, you know, like I went in, I had a good chat. I wasn't nervous um, to go into the surgery. I was more nervous about this one um, because I'm not great with getting needles in. So I knew it was going to hurt. Um, but overall, it didn't hurt at all. It was good. Um, but I was more nervous about getting that in the actual surgery itself. So uh when i got into the wheeled into the surgery room i uh got asked to scooch over to the other bed and i did that and then they went to put a mask over my face and i thought it was just an os oxygen mask um but <laughs> clearly not because i think it was on about one second and then i woke back up in my ward um in my room <laughs> and because you're still groggy i instantly said oh my god did i not have surgery like what the hell um so i physically had to go just checking that I had wounds and so, but um yeah it's uh I definitely had surgery it was all good apparently it was really good it took a little bit longer than expected um but otherwise it was all good uh, which made Michael's surgery a little bit more delayed I don't think he went into about two but I suppose we'll know more then um other than that uh I'm, yeah I'm feeling good my wounds itself don't hurt um it's just the gas pain that's a little bit uncomfortable, but I wouldn't say it's um, it's bad. So nothing we can't handle, we're women, and that's what women deal with general pain, aches and pains every day. So um, yeah, certainly able to handle that. Anyway, so I'll hopefully get a video of us when I when Michael wakes up and, we can, and I can get him to go for a bit of a walk and whatever. All right, see you guys.